This video will demonstrate how to install the Upper Baby Mesa carrier only in a vehicle using a seatbelt. One of the first things you need to do when you're installing with carrier only is you need to evaluate where your locking mechanism is in your seatbelt. And in order to do that, it's either in your retractor, which is where your seatbelt comes out of, or it's in something called the latch plate. And if you're unsure, a good method of reference is going to be your vehicle owner's manual. This should tell you what kind of locking mechanism you have in your seatbelt. After you determine where your locking mechanism is in your seatbelt, with the Mesa, you have to make sure that no portion of the front vehicle seat is touching any portion of our carrier. So it's important to ensure the seat back is at an appropriate angle where no touching is occurring. You're going to take the carrier, the Mesa carrier, and you're going to place it on your vehicle seat cushion. You want to make sure that this line right here is level to the ground. And what that does is that makes sure that this angle is maintained so that the baby's head isn't um, too far back or too far forward. So the next step is to be grabbing your vehicle belt. These little blue guides right here are actually our seat belt guides. And I say blue because if you were to reference your car seat manual, which you should also be doing on top of listening to this video, everything is color coded blue in our manual to indicate seatbelt install. Our seatbelt in this vehicle is locking in the retractor. So I'm going to pull it all the way out. I'm not sure if you can hear that ratcheting. So as I am pulling it, pulled it out, I'm feeding it in and at the same time I'm going to apply pressure in something we call the seat bite, which is where your cushion and your back meet right here. So as I remove all the slack out of the lap belt, I'm gonna feed the shoulder belt into the retractor. There we go. And the last thing I'm going to do is be checking in the belt path. So you should have no more than one inch movement in the cross car direction. If for any reason you have a little bit of tipping this way, it's okay with the Mesa to provide a large towel rolled up under, underneath in this location right here. And that's how you do carrier-only install.